All right, so we just want to say that we're at the home of um, Miss Mary Ross, Miss Mary Ross, who is 101 years old. And her birthday is um, March, March, the, huh? March 18th. The 18th. What year were you born, Mother? Totally born. March 18, 1921. All right. All right. Okay, so I'm Dia Yoka J.C. Sovala, and we're on a mission, and our mission is to aid our community in understanding who they are and how they are connected to each other. Mm -hmm. We're in the process of uh, putting all this information finally in a book form. And the title of the book is Blood is Thicker Than Water. And whenever uh, we think about blood is thicker, thicker than water, we're talking about relatives. And so uh, at this point, we've uh, talked with uh, Mother Ruth Ellen Gaskin Simmons. And now we're at the home of Mother, uh, she's not Mother, she's no. a Miss Mary, a sister Mary Ross. Mm -hmm. Hobbs Ross. Hobbs Ross. Mary Hobbs, H O B B S Ross. And Miss uh, Hobbs Ross lives with her daughter. And they have such a beautiful relationship of how she stays with one daughter for a while and she moves to another daughter. And that is such a, a unique way that they um, manage her and takes care of her. Mm. And she's willing to move from one house to the other, which is a great thing. Um, at this time, I want to uh, talk in terms of Adolfo and uh, Deborah from the University of Florida, Samuel Proctor's Oral History Department, who has agreed to come and to assist us by videoing uh, Ms. Ross. So at this time, we will turn it over to uh, Adolfo to engage us with some questions, Mother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you can tell, you can say what you want to say, and you don't have to say what you don't want to say. Mm -hmm. Is that good? Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Well, thank you for having us here today. My name is Adolfo Romero. And uh, today we're, I'm here to ask you a couple of questions. Uh, so going back to your early days, we're going to begin uh, back in the 1920s. What are some of, where were you born and raised? Let's begin with that. Where were you born? Where were where? you born and raised? Well, I was born at Raymond. Out here in Manioka. Mm -hmm. Manioka. Okay, what are some of the earliest memories that you have as a kid, as a child? Memories as a child? Let me see. Can you remember when you were a child? No, no, I remember. That's a long time, yes, isn't it? Yes, it sure has. Uh -huh. Did yeah. you have any buddies that you used to run with? I remember when I started in school at Jerusalem along the way. I started at school. Now, where was that school? Jerusalem was right over here. On the, uh huh. Back over there. Okay. And I was running about six or seven years old because they had a big old parent a teacher. Mm -hmm. A parent that had big. Big sheets of paper with letters on it, A's mm. and B's, led me in. Mm. That's when they started to teach me right about six or seven years old when I started there. Susan mm. Wilson. Susan Wilson? Yeah. Was, was the teacher? Yeah. Wow. Who built that school? Well, I don't know. I, the county, I guess. 
All I know, I just was going to school. I don't know who built it, mm-hmm, but it was mm-hmm. built when they started me going to school there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let me get that mask on first. Mm-hmm. Can I do that? Take that mask off. Mm-hmm. You can understand for, the, mm-hmm. for them to pick it up better. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, do you remember uh, which kids would go to school with you? Uh, do you still remember some of their names? of, uh, yeah, children that you would play with around the neighborhood or in the school? What he means, the, the class your friends who That's went to school with you. Oh, Lord, they all but did, but, yeah. mm-hmm. oh, my Lord. And I don't, I don't believe Grace. none of them. I went to school, Grace and Young. I, with your, I went to school with Sugar. Ollie Irvin, I, we call her Sugar. Ollie Irvin, my auntie. Yeah. My daddy's sister. Yeah, I went to school with her. Me and her were friends. Uh-huh. Yeah, I went to school with her. Yeah. And some more of them. Mm-hmm. Gracie Young. Gracie yeah, Young. Odessa, Odessa Young. Yes. Mm-hmm. Odessa Young. Mm-hmm. Odessa Young. Mm-hmm. Odessa Young and all uh, Mariah Hill. I know she was a young guy at that time. Really? Mariah Young. Real young and Miss Ross. Oh God. Lord. Oh, what did you're it? doing good. <laughs> you're doing great. So Mariah, who's yeah. who's uh, uh Ophelia's mother? No, uh, it was her Ophelia and uh, the one her uh, aunt or something, she was told because the, the grandma raised them. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. You remember the name of the grandmother? Susan the right now. Real young was the granddaddy. Oh, okay. And what what that what what the husband there? Right now I did it. Real young and and um uh, you know it wasn't flops. Mm-hmm. What is that woman name? Yeah, I can't call it, but real young was the daddy, uh-huh. the granddaddy of them. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Do you rem- do you remember any stories about how this Monioka area came about, because Oakey Woods keeps coming up, that some of them came from Oakey Woods, which is near La Crosse. Do you remember hearing any stories of who started this? How did you all get here, this place? How did, what was Cousin Ada, your mother? I don't know. Who Where did was. they come from? Rick, let me get that. My, when my mama got out there in the garden, she come out from a uh, place they called, uh, what, they, the, what that old church was? Bell? New Bell? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. First, first I know she come out from there. From that area. From that area. Uh-huh. And Mitchell Hills, they oh, say. Oh, yes. Mitchell Mitch Hills, Hill. which was my great-grandfather. That's right. Uh-huh. They Mitch say build Hill. that. Look like to be Mrs. Hill. Uh huh. Mrs. Hill, as far as I know, was the big man with all the land. Yeah. And people rented the land from Mrs. Hill, could daughter, daddy. Yeah. My my grandmother, Rizella, they call her daughter. Yeah. Rizella Hill Irvin. Yeah. Mm hmm. Wow, that's a long time ago. Yes. I remember mm. it. Now, and she was much older than you then, huh? Yes. You know, I the real, when I was a little girl, my m- mom and daddy would talk about uh, Mr. Hill, who the land belongs to. Right. Mr. Hill. Now, yeah. that's where I get it from. And who was your mama and daddy? Jim Harvey was my daddy. Uh-huh. And Ada McGinnis was my mama. Mm-hmm. But when my daddy came in from North Carolina, Parkersburg, mm-hmm. North Carolina, he said, I'm going to take this what he said. He said he come in from North Carolina, Parkersburg, North Carolina to mm-hmm. Florida. Mm-hmm. And when he got to Florida, now it might have been more time he stopped it till. But he said when he got to Florida, he went to where the black people was living mm-hmm, at. Mm-hmm. And he when he got to my daddy, my 
my mama house, mm -hmm. see, it was a b bunch of girls there. <laughs> and see, he picked my mama out from the All bunch of girls. girls. Now, wow. he told that when he got with his children. Mm -hmm. He said, I didn't told us. He come on the floor and met my mama there with her daddy and my mama. Mm -hmm. My mama, mama named it uh, Nancy. And my daddy and her, my granddad was Tony McGinnis. Tony and, McGinnis? Yeah. I remember that name. Yeah, yeah. And so when he got there, he said, oh, amongst all them girls, he picked my mama <laughs> amongst all the girls. And David he got married from that place out from the Oakie Wood. That's when he was all come out. But all oh. they see, the Oakie Wood, but now, since I got up big enough, I've been back out there. was a salesman. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And there are a few people still living there. Oh, there is? Yeah. And I visit the cemetery out there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And, and get, none of the names I recognize, though. Yeah. Get your singleton come out from there. Get, oh, get you. Yeah. Get Melissa Stanley mm -hmm. first. Yes. 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 Yeah. Wow, your memory is awesome. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm, I'm taking herbs now, trying to clear my brain <laughs> so that I can have a mind like you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. Could you tell us a little bit about your father and mother? What did they do? Uh, yes, what did they do for work or? Oh, for work. Yes. My dad was a uh, they sewing. And, and couldn't ties and all that. But my mama was wrapped with my daddy. She worked in the woodlawn with him. Was he a farmer? A big farmer. That's after, it. After you got, I got up a little girl, big enough to know the farm, my daddy was the biggest black man with a farm. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, yeah. one yeah. of these playing everything I can name it out. What he planted, I guess in morning. Mm -hmm. Uh cucumber, string bean, eggplant, bell pepper. Mm. He planted all of that. And when he would go sell it, he would load up that old truck and go over to Jacksonville. It was a place there in Jacksonville, they call it the farm market. Mm -hmm. That's where my dad would go sell all that stuff at. And I was hearing him coming in with that old truck, and he was blue. I <laughs> run to the gate and open the gate and let him ride on in. Because I know he had some good old bananas when he come in there. <laughs> well, yeah, I see you plenty. it. Yeah. Well, but I heard that he was uh, pretty well off. Oh, he, he had was. plenty of money now. Yeah, yeah, he did. Mm -hmm. Mama sold them cows and sold a, oh, he was almost, I would say, a horse shooter. Lonnie McDavid got his men what he worked for. Come up there and drove the cows, what my mom, what my daddy left. He, he come up there, the big white man come up there, and I guess she was selling them, but now I'm being a child, I don't know how much money she got out of them. But when my daddy died, my mom sold that. And all the mules and, and the horse he had. Mm -hmm. But I didn't know how much money she got out of it. But she sold all my daddy's stuff mm -hmm. while he died and left. Mm -hmm. So he, they, she sold it to Lonnie McDavid. Yes, Lonnie which was, McDavid. Which was a, 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 a white gentleman who farmed our land. Yes, mm -hmm. sure did. Mm -hmm. Your granddad, yes, uh, Lana Mac, they was the biggest white man on the store. That's the way we went on to the store mm -hmm. and bought clothes, cloth. Mm -hmm. uh, that to make the clothes. Mm -hmm. Lana Mac David. Mm -hmm. now, Mama, didn't your, your father have an old, uh, one of the first motor vehicles? Yes. Uh, yes, oh. he did. First, yeah. he was the first one to have a vehicle, own yeah. a vehicle. Yes. Wow. Old truck. Yes, he did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good. In addition good. to the horse and buggy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember that old thing was kind of ragged and broke down, but it was standing there, and that's why he used to ride it, coat my mama in. Mm -hmm. But it was towed down like, 
I remember it. Mm -hmm. I just want to make sure that we don't forget, uh, you mentioned that you attend school in the, in this Manioka community. Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. And the name of that school was... What? Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Because oh, at one time, this area was known as Jerusalem. All right. We have Jerusa uh, Old Jerusalem Missionary Baptist Church. You. We have New Jerusalem right. Baptist Church. We have Jerusalem Church of God by Faith. Right. So this oh. area. So how is it that we lost I that name? I don't know how come they changed it down to Montague. Mm -hmm. And wouldn't keep the old name Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So wouldn't. They changed it. Mm -hmm. Why was it named Jerusalem? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. what, wonder why was it named Jerusalem? I don't know. We're not big enough to know. It. The white and the black was going out there. There was a church they called the Old Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. And they was going out there. And they get on the floor. Well, I couldn't remember, but Mama would tell me, and I see him out there shouting and the swing over street. Terrier. Coming to carry me home. Mm -hmm. That's the song them folks would be singing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how it got there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that part yeah. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But it was a bunch of people. Yes. Out there doing that time. Mm -hmm. uh, what about Mount Olive? Uh, someone told me that Mount Olive church that's on uh, Northeast 15th Street was, it was started out in the Ruder Branch area. Yeah. Uh-huh, which is just west of us. Right. Okay. Mm. Prim Primitive Baptist. Baptist. Well, uh -huh. you took it someone used to pastor that church. Yes. That's been my first husband, his family, my grandma, I at least uh, my First husband, mama and them come out from that church. Mm -hmm. And after then, time passes. After then, I got married into that family, mm -hmm. the, the Wilson family. Mm -hmm. And so it moved. Took it, someone moved it. Carry over there again. Then I guess we, we the people, yes. we more members and yes. whatnot. They read it, the church went. And I don't know whether they still got it. It's they still moved from right yeah. over there. It's still there. It's on uh, just off of Eighth Avenue mm -hmm. on Northeast Fifteenth Street. Just right on the right hand that. side. After they left from out there. Mama was telling me yeah. that, that church. Okay, let, let's mm -hmm. ask. Uh huh. So, so what sort of things did you do in that church? Was the feet washing? Well, they started feet washing, mm -hmm. and the people went to talking about what. Washing one another's food. Who gonna wash this one for? I ain't gonna wash. They started that mess, and so he soon went out. It went down. It sure did. Yes. Mm -hmm. oh. Wow. Uh huh. So, so please um, name um, because we're making sure that we capture all the names of the families. Can you remember? I want you to name all of your children, but I want you to talk about which, uh, you mentioned Mitchell Hills, who had a lot of money. He was a horse trader. Oh, and, yes. And so when he- When he died, that guy could get out of school. Your Honor, I don't know, but that guy, guy, my daddy died with a hundred dollars in, uh, in his pocket. That mm. guy would do that. Sugar would do that, if you want to know her name. Uh -huh. Sugar. Uh huh. Ollie Irvin. Ollie Irvin. My uh -huh. granddaddy died with a hundred dollars in his pocket. That's what you get out and tell us children. So during that time, a hundred dollars was a lot of money. Yes, it was. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was. Mm -hmm. Sure did. Yeah, well, she would get out of that school and and bully the other us children about, <laughs> about it. <laughs> Oh, dear. I'm talking of the truth. I know I mean, I was in a bunch uh -huh. listening at her. Yes, yes, yes. I don't know who, who told her, but that's what she said. Mm -hmm. Now, who are the other families <laughs> other than Mitchell Hills? Who are some of the, in, in your family, the McGinnis? Who are some of the other uh, families, families in this area? Because we, when we say this area, we are talking about... Um, Jerusalem, which is Manioc now, Gordon, mm -hmm. and Lacrosse. 
Mm -hmm. Uh huh. So who were some of the families that you remember, the names of those families? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to talk about. Yeah. Um, yo, what did uh, Mr. Hill do? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He was a big man. Mm -hmm. That man built the God, that school, mm -hmm. a school and a church. Mm -hmm. Mr. Hill built that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mama, did you hear the question? What? Who were some of the families that you can remember when you were growing up? The names of the families when you were growing up. The Banks you know, family. we have the Bankses and we have the I know, Hills but when, when I was them. growing up, the, the boys was, I know, I believe them boys was older than the girls. Uh, you wouldn't know. Eddie Hill was one of them. Milford Hill was the other one. Because Mills for here, the one getting church and said, My Lord. Some guy's song, I know it, but I can't think of now, old song. He sing that song all the time. Mm -hmm. Come, you know Mr. Mi Milford. Milford. Yes, Milford, Milford Hills. Hills. Yeah, I remember and you. I, and I was a, it was another one in the, in the book, but he got a better name in the book. Right, what? I forgot what his real name is. Mm -hmm. All of them were young boys. Mm -hmm. They was all in name, but I can't remember them. Uh -huh. What are the names of families? The McGinnises? Yeah. McGinnises was family? Wilsons? Yeah, yeah. Uh, can you remember the, the uh, who, who, what other McGinnis names other than Cousin Ada, Ada McGinnis? All what other names do you remember? Let me see. Who, who, were, who were her sisters? Who was... Uh, oh, God. Mama, sister. Yes. Um, did she have any, Did she have any sisters? Who, mama? She oh. said one. What was the name? Uh, Take your hand uh, down, mama. And, and, and Retta. What was our right name? Henry. Uncle Manchie. Miss Henry. Henry. Henretta. Henretta who? And a rough. Great too. McGinnis. McGinnis Smith. Uh, Henretta McGinnis Smith. Yeah. Okay. And, and Gertrude? And Gertrude, that was Mama's sister, Gertrude. McGinnis. Yes. Uh huh. And she married a who? A Roe? Uh, uh, R O S S. Oh. Ross. It, no, it wasn't a Ross. R O W. -E, e, R O W E. Something like that in there. Yeah, like Peace Eye Hilda's uh, was a row. Those yeah. Ones. But married into that family. Wow. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. She married in that family, mm -hmm. but I can't. That boy used to be living down there in the Fort Lauderdale. Mm -hmm. uh, no, no. It's raw, but it had a W in it. Right, mm -hmm. right. W what about the uh, Gilmores? Well, I ain't know too much about. I know the children, but I ain't know really. They come from out of there. What names do you remember? Uh, Tootie uh, Gilmore, but he had a better name in that. Her, was it Hercules? No, Hercules, Hercules was the oldest. Yeah. Hercules, Hercules Gilmore Taft. was the oldest. Uh huh. Taft, Taft, Taft. Taft, Taft was Tootie Gilmore. Yeah, dad. Taft, I mean, see, Tootie, uh, Taft, yeah. Tootie Gilmore. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, and Benny Gilmore. Benny, right? Okay, mm -hmm. okay. I think it was extreme. Men, the boys I know, uh -huh. Taff and our uh, Hercules mm -hmm. and Benny. Okay. All they places down there. Right. The road, in I'm Gordon. Gonna... This was yeah. in Gordon. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What about the Gainers? Elijah Gainey. Yo, the no. Gainers. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Elijah, Elijah Gainey. Did he have any brothers? Or who was his? What Cooter Gainey name is? Leroy. Leroy, Leroy Cooter Gainey. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Them the two boys, uh, well, one of them died. What did his name was? Oh, Lord, oh, Lord. No. Um, because he married in the family. I don't know his name. I went to school. What about with Prince? The, Prince? Prince Ganey, the my cousin. Mm -hmm. Them the cousin to the Ganey. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Were you related to all the people that we've mentioned? The Hills, the Gilmores, well, the Ganey? I, I was coming. Related to the hills more, but not the Gilmore. Mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm. But I know them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, the banks. Did you mention any 
banks. And no, no. They, no. they were later. Were they later? The Ooh. banks. Uh, what? Ooh. Dinner banks. Little bank. Oh yeah. Who who were his um, children? Leonard Banks. Leonard Banks. Oh, he killed a Caesar. Caesar Banks. Glenn. Glenn. Yeah. Uh, Caesar Glenn. Lewis. Lewis. Jolly. They call him Jolly. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Jolly. Lewis Jolly Banks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? What was the mother name? Beery. Yeah, yeah Beery. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, uh, Beery Mother Banks. Mm hmm. Yeah. Uh huh. Now yeah. these were all sisters and brothers. Yes. Wow. Now can 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 we bring it down further? Who were their children? Beery over there. She was named. Beery. You know Beery. Beery, uh, Beery was named after. The one we told you. Uh huh. The mother. Her okay. Beery was named after her mother. The mm -hmm. same name. Mm -hmm. Wow. And the grandmother's name also was. Why? Yeah. So there were the grandmother was Beria, named what nickname? Mitt. Mitt. Beery Mitt. Mm -hmm. What was Mitt's last name? Uh, she married a Banks, but I'm not sure. Okay, so she Banks. She was a Smith. Smith. A Beery Mitt Smith Banks. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then we had um, the, the second Beery, the daughter. Was also Beery, mm -hmm. and, and Beery mid, middle uh, nickname Mudder, mm -hmm. um, Smith, Cremati, but she was a Smith first. Banks. She was a Banks. Yeah. Cremati, Beery, Smith, Beery Mudder, Smith, Cremati. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, Come you see why we have to do this? And mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, the, the, the recent one. Uh, okay. Jean's mom, Norris. Okay, so then you have Beery. What Norris. was... What? I don't know a nickname. Her, mic, her, her maiden name. Cromartie. Uh-huh. Beery Cromartie yeah. Norris. Yeah. Uh-huh. Irma Jean and Carl are, are, is, uh, are her children. Yeah, and uh -huh. Sammy Jr. And Sammy Jr. Mm -hmm. May he rest in peace. Uh. Alfonso. And Alfonso. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, Sam is not dead, no, but it's Alf Alfonso. Alfonso is dead. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, Mother. Manioc is something, isn't it? It is. I remember when uh, we celebrated your 100th birthday. Yeah. Uh huh. And somebody made the comment that it was so good. Uh, to, to have been around you mm -hmm. because you taught them the value of owning land. Do you still feel that way? Do you think there's a value, it's a benefit, it's good to own your land? Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's good to own it, yeah. Mm-hmm. And to hold on to your land. Yes, it is. Mm-hmm. I have a question. Uh, how did your father get, uh, acquire, get the land? How did he get the land that he had? Because how did he get the land? Who who sold the land to him, or how did he get it? My, uh, my daddy. Yes. I don't know how he got it. I just talking about uh, your husband when you married. Daddy. Was he how married? Did he get the land? How did daddy get the land? I don't guess he bought it. I guess. He what he was out there cutting on it. You know some story? Her father had land. And okay. then when she got married, she married someone with land, married into a family okay. with land. So all this land that we're on was our father's land, and she married our you father. Mm -hmm. okay. So which question you asked about her, her father? Her father, yeah. Her father. Mm -hmm. her father. So Let me do get you this. know how granddaddy Jim yeah. Hobbs mm -hmm. acquired his land? Do you know how he got his land? His 40 acres? Well, I don't know how he got it. The first thing, now he wasn't there on that on the first thing. I would say mama had two sets. The first set of children, what mama had, because it was terrible of us. Mama was staying on some white man place. I guess farming or do something, because them first children 
was older than me, what daddy and go. Them boys was help my daddy on that part of that. So mm-hmm. when I got up old enough and whatnot, he had bought that land over there. Mm-hmm. Them forty five land. Mm-hmm. I knew. He must have worked on it. He must have worked. Now now the story is that Mitchell Hills uh, had a lot of land that he gave to a lot of his relatives. It's over there. Mm-hmm. I don't know why why he got them, but it's over there. Mm-hmm. You, you know where that land is. Yes, had. yes, yes. Yeah. Because all the houses from the Acon, across the street from the Acon Clinic, coming toward Maniok, toward Jerusalem, uh, the names are hills. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. So he gave those uh, acreages to his family people. Now, I don't yes. know how he got the land. I don't need to. All I know, he was a big man out there. Mm-hmm. A big old man out there, out there in Gassel, man. And right. He owned it. In Gordon. In Gordon. Now, he owned it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.
He come out, it was two black men come out there. Angel corner. One went one way mm -hmm. and build up that community. Mm -hmm. I tell you, the community they call it Walkie Hootie. And yes. the other one, <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. the other one built up where you, like that. The, the Gordon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what mm -hmm. I hear. Mm -hmm. That's all. That's all. Road. Yeah, yeah. All that area. Mm -hmm. So, Mama, you heard that story? Oh, yes, yeah. I know. It with it's people a common story. Like uh -huh. it, was yeah. a, it was a man, was a, a black man was riding a horse, they say, had to go around and, and, and give people the mail, riding a horse, the mail man. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, Miss, Miss Bertha Lee, Bertha Lee Lee, <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. is a historian, mm -hmm. and she has that whole story. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. So at some point in time, we need to... Uh, interview her mm -hmm. in order to get the clarity of that story. But you're right. She lives in Jacksonville. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. mm -hmm. But she still attend, comes every Sunday to the church in the Saranola area. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that was maybe that, that side. But what about on this side? You know, the the, gone over. that's gone. Yeah. It, I know, so. Well, I don't know how the land was acquired. I don't know how the land was acquired, but the story is that uh, Baby Singleton, who is David Singleton, and my grandfather, um, Abe Irvin, were the ones who initiated and were able to get um, this property. And, and, but they came from Oakey Woods. Mm -hmm. So I, I want to know what happened in Oakey Woods why the folks left that area and saying. came here. Yeah. I came to this there's area. There's another name. I haven't heard my uh, grandfather's name, Martin Wilson, because Martin Wilson name. had all this land in here. Really? Uh -huh. It's over where the Loopy Foundation is The now. what found it? The Louis, where the bats? The bats. The bats, uh-huh. Um, yes. But he couldn't pay the taxes on that portion, mm -hmm. so they had to let that portion go mm -hmm. and then held on to, to mm -hmm. this. Mm -hmm. But uh, so he was landed. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, landed. And his name is what? Martin Wilson. Martin Wilson. Um, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. There's mm -hmm. quite a few of them, but they mm -hmm. lived in this area. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nobody said anything from Oakey Wood about the Martin. You don't have anything documented on Martin Wood. No, I don't. But the thing of it is we can um, make sure that when we go to Oakey Woods to mention Martin Wilson. Yes, okay. You may have to text that name to me. I left yeah, my um, pen in the car. You do. Yeah, Martin. Oh, thank you. Martin Wilson. Mm. And uh, I'm trying to... Think. His, his mother's name was Carrie. I don't know his granddaddy, but the mother's name was Carrie. Carrie mm -hmm. well, well, wait a minute. Martin was married to Carrie. Mm -hmm. I think that's what it was. So you and and I think Carrie was a sweat. A sweat? Sweat. Mm. S-W-E-A-T. And who's Carrie? Um, Martin's wife, my grandmother the on my daddy's side. And my daddy was a Wilson. We we are all we are Mama Mary Wilson. All the children are Wilsons. Okay. Mm -hmm. And Hobbs is her second mm -hmm. husband. Mm -hmm. I mean, not Hobbs, but uh, Ross. 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 Mm -hmm. Mary, I have a question. You lived throughout the Great Depression, World War One. You lived through a lot of events, big events in the U.S. Can you tell us a little bit about your life? Just a a little bit about about you and growing up, and then what did you do as a teenager, transition to your twenties, thirties, and so forth? What can you guide us a little bit on that? Now, now you know, you you know, understand what he's saying. You, during that troubled time of wars, during war time, what mm -hmm. did we as a people in this community do? What did you do during war time? Did we notice that there was a war even? Mm-hmm, I remember. Mm hmm Because all the boys went to the war back in 30, 
My daddy was still on that place over there in the thirties. I remember that we, a big stone storm come up and blow up the big oak tree. Remember that. He had to get out there and So did y'all have to, you know, search for food or were, did you have enough to eat? Or no, no, we, it was a tank gave out the food. You couldn't have, well, I couldn't have that time. They Take giving. your hand down. They was uh, giving out, uh, I don't know, or, or can be a or, Commodity? Yeah, that's what they was giving mm -hmm. out during that in Hoobie time. Hoobie, mm -hmm. President Hoobie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, it was pretty good. I remember that. Was that in the 30s? Um, late 30s, late 30s, early 40s. Yeah. Yeah. So how was it for you growing up as a teenager? Well, as a teenager? Yeah. I worked on the farm, my daddy's farm, and then I would go out and and work on the... You know, white people, we all would we go home uh, bell pepper and mm -hmm. this whole and set out uh, the tomatoes and the things mm -hmm. like that for mm -hmm. the white folks. Yeah, I uh, was home there. So w w was there ever a shortage of food in our community? I don't know. Because we were farmers. Yes, that's so, what I'm so saying. So even though they brought commodity out, yeah. We, we well, really we was, was not, uh, we were not suffering for hunger, food. no. No, because my daddy was a big farmer, all exactly. that stuff. He would plant mm -hmm. and get the high people, high people helped get mm -hmm. off the farm because we weren't, I guess, old enough or what not to go out there and help pick it. Mm -hmm. out there. You had to pick that stuff yourself or you to get somebody mm -hmm. to help pick it and then get it up and go sell it. Well, that's what he did. Got people, how many of um, my um, uh, black men, my daddy, young men, my daddy had on the farm, about four or five of them on the farm working, mm -hmm. bringing us up, working for us, mm -hmm. and helped bought me up because we wasn't big enough to do nothing, so he had to hide people, men. Mm -hmm. And he paid them. I don't know how he got the money from them, but he had to pay them. Maybe from selling the other vegetables. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's all I can remember, mm -hmm. things like that. And how would Grandma make your clothes during that time? She on an old machine. She had a sewing machine that yeah, she old machine. would machine. make your clothes. Yeah, mm -hmm. Yeah. Go over there to Brooklyn to the store and buy the cloth mm -hmm. and cut it out. Mm -hmm. Make it in this style, what the style he had up. Mm -hmm. She would make it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, Mom, do you know any of the men or boys that went to war? Who? Do you know any of the men? Did, did you know any of the, like, the men who went to war? This I know. Uh, Isaiah Wilson, uh, mm -hmm. Jesse Cook, uh, Gail Cooper. Mm -hmm. Cooper mm -hmm. and uh, uh, A.J. Irvin, Clyde yes, yes. Irvin. Yes. They all. Mm -hmm. uh, Even the Woodrow, Woodrow Wal uh, Ross. Yeah, went to the army, yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. How did their families do after they went to war? Well, them what got lost in there, they got checked. Mm -hmm. oh. they, they men got lost and they got checked for them. But they didn't have a hard time. No, it wasn't no hard time because they got that little, I don't know how much money they'll get, but they got a check when the people died in the, uh, in the war time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you remember anybody that uh, did not come back from mm -hmm. the war? It, yeah, it's a bunch of them. <laughs> what the ghost on? Didn't come back. No, he didn't come back. Mm -hmm. Guston, uh, oh goodness. Mm -hmm. I know these people now. Jesse, Jesse again. Uh, I think that was his boy. I tell you, who his sister, Curran and uh, Rostine, mm -hmm. that was their brother, went to the service and he didn't come back. Mm -hmm. Guston did not come back. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. I don't know what how to spell that gusto on the gusto on. Mm-hmm. Just like it sounds G U S T O N E. Mm-hmm. He didn't come back. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And uh, uh it was uh Robinson boy didn't come back. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. I can't call it now, but he didn't come back. Boston mm-hmm. Robbers. What was his name? A man here today that was like y'all don't know him. Mm-hmm. I never knew his name. Mm-hmm. He didn't come mm-hmm. back. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But but, but the mm-hmm. 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 he didn't come back. Mm-hmm. But they got some kind of check for him. Mm-hmm. For mm-hmm. him. My dad always said, if the if Uncle Sam owes you anything, you'll get it. I don't know how true that is. I don't know. Back there, <laughs> he got it. Back there, they got that. Say, if they check. owe you a penny, they, 25 cents, he got a check for 25 cents. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh. I know they got the check. Because they, 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 they lived the office a while anyhow. I mm. know Joe Nelson doesn't know. He got a check off of his son didn't come back. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You didn't know mm-hmm. Joe Nelson and Mariah had a son to go to the army mm-hmm. and they got chilly in there. Or uh, something happened to him, they got a check for it. Joe Nelson would get that little check. And who was John um, Nelson's wife? M- Mariah. Mariah. Yeah. Valentine before she married Joe Nelson. Yeah. Yeah. He sure did. His oldest boy got killed, and he's getting a check. And they see that's the biggest what they were living off of. At that time, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But they got the check. Mm-hmm. Did they marry young? Yeah. Uh-huh. The, yeah uh, how, old, how old were the people who normally got married? What was the marrying age? How how young or how I old? I don't know how old or young it was. I sure don't. Did people get married in their teens or 20s or what? I don't know that. Mm-hmm. I don't know that, but how they got married. Mm-hmm. But they see they was married, all I could tell you. Mm-hmm. They ain't got to tell the young people that much. Yeah, but generally, I, it, I mean, generally, did people get married early or later? When I was got up old enough to know they would get married because they would have it at the church. Mm-hmm. And then some would, would go to the courthouse. Mm-hmm. I didn't know that little <laughs> boy. They went up there for him to take care of the little young and what he had got by this girl. Mm-hmm. And he didn't want to do it. And what did that man to him? The head boss to the, to the courthouse. Keep feeling, feeling and love him. You will love him and take him yours. He told mm-hmm. something like, well, I know the boy that he told that, but. The judge, the, the judge. The judge, that one. Mm-hmm. He told something, yeah. But, Mama, your friend, the girls you grew up with, about how old were they when they married? And you? Who? How old were you when you got married? And, oh, and your you friends? Know. I was running about, was 14, no, 15. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But you weren't 15. How old were you when you got married? I told her I was running about 15 or 16. No, you were 18. You were 18, you told her. Mm-hmm. That's what, yeah. I don't mm-hmm. know. I told her. Uh, mm-hmm. But most of them were like 15 or, or I went to the court hall. Mm-hmm. Because Mama went and my sister went. They signed mm-hmm. to that little old. Judge, a little skinny. Mm-hmm. Do you find that um, nowadays uh, people don't go to church as much as they used to? Every Sunday, it seemed like did most people go to church every Sunday? Mm-hmm. Or, 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 as far as I know. Mm-hmm. Unlike to, today, they stay home and look at TV, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. They look at TV because when I would go to church, them older people were there because mm-hmm. going to church and they singing and praying and everything. Mm-hmm. But now the old young people don't care. They don't care about going and hearing the preacher preachers. 
and all, but back then, in that time, they went. That's it. They went. E even those who parted the night before. Well, they went to church the that's next, the next day. Out, so that's whatever. That's a they Sunday. Sure mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But not ill. They don't yeah. think it's mm -hmm. for God. And sometimes it's, twice a day. Huh? Yeah. You had the more the regular church in the morning and then evening church. The evening. YP is not oh, uh -uh. W W W what was it called? They Something. Don't do that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I have a question. Uh, what made Jerusalem a special place from other towns? What, ma what made uh, this area, Jerusalem, a special place more I, than other places? I don't know unless they got it out the Bible. Because in the Bible, that's where Jesus done his changing and had his meaning. Read it. Read the Bible. Mm -hmm. Jerusalem mm -hmm. in the Bible. Mm -hmm. And that's why I believe in it, because mm -hmm. I, I read it in the Bible. Mm -hmm. and that's where Jesus would uh, do the, the separation they would go. Mm -hmm. And them big men would, you know, I guess he must have come up with them, you know, get them changed, they go different places, and mm -hmm. go pre preach different places. Mm -hmm. Now, that's the only thing I can see where that Jew would have come from. But because when I got up big enough, Mama would go to old Jew and Baptist church on right. the other side of that school there. Mm -hmm. And there was folk, uh, white men and white women, black women, all the girls up in there. Oh, really? Yes, sir. I know what I talk about. She kept me right long with her. Mm. She had me right with her. Because I know Lonnie McDavid, a white man, had a grocery store oh, yeah. just uh, uh, just east of us. Yes. Mm -hmm. And his wife named the Ruth. Oh, okay. Yeah, Lonnie McDavid's wife named Miss Ruth. Okay. I had two girls, Misra and, uh, what was it, Misra and, what that gal named? Avis. Avis and Misra. Mildred and who? A Avis. 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 And I asked the custom, the little barefoot girl up there, one day I was up there, oh yeah, I ain't forgot it, the Lana McDavis show. All right, the old bus come up and picked up Lana McDavis children. Yeah, he did. Picked up a carried them to school, and I wanted to know why is it they had a bus? Had since 32. Wanted to know why the white children had a bus to ride the school. Right there, the Lonnie McDavid store, he had a porch on it. Mm -hmm. Right there on the porch, I want to know. And, they didn't and how, did you, how did you get to school? Walk barefeet. Wow. wow. Yes, mm -hmm. I did. Barefeet mm -hmm. the school. Mm -hmm. How long would it take you to walk to school? <laughs> It was around about 10 o'clock, because then I guess when they first started the, with the classes. Mm -hmm. From where I was sitting at, back old Yana you know, I mean, Vista, that and that. Mm -hmm. yeah. And so, what time would you start walking to school? After breakfast. After I met my freshman, had a little lunch. I don't know. Around about 8 or 9 o'clock. Take you about an hour to walk to school? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I believe it was, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Wow. Was life good back then? Well, it was pretty good to be walking, carrying our little lunch at school mm -hmm. then, learning. And sometimes in a paper bag, and next time she bought a little old thing, cook the way you could put it in there mm -hmm. and slam the top on it and fasten you carry it in a little like Book. a lunch, a pail of lunch yeah. bucket. Lunch yeah. bucket. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. What about crime? Did we have as much crime back then oh. within our community? Crime. Yeah, was people killing or yeah. stealing? stealing? Yes. Stealing and killing, yeah. I don't want to go into the white folk and people killing them. I don't like to go and talk about it. But yeah, killing and hanging. Oh, hanging the whites, hanging the blacks. Yes. Mm -hmm. Did you remember Moses Smith at all? He was hung in the Gordon area. 
Did you ever hear of him, that hanging? You know, I remember one. When the tongue, when they first started the tongue off. Mm -hmm. What was his name? I don't know what that man, he's strange, or had a family, and come and moved mm. it on the tongue all down there. And the tongue you see, it's there. They met somebody sitting on the white folk. And so, that year had hogs. And this black man, and he had a wife and children. And he declared he, I didn't see, well, that's what I hear. That man got up in the tree, I remember that. And he shot that man down out that tree. Mm. Killed him, yeah, I remember. I can tell you. <laughs> mm. Some of the people, what it was, because I had a cousin married one of the daughters. That, them people moved down there. But anyhow, the white people shot him out the tree, and he was dead. So that's why I don't like to talk about it. Mm -hmm. they, plenty of people was killed, and, and, and black people and put out there and, and piled up, and piled up wood on top of them. Mm -hmm. I right there and seen it. Logs. Mm -hmm. Buried them under the no, log. No, put the log on top of them mm -hmm. and, and burn them up. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Set them on fire. Mm. Now, I can tell you who told it. Taffy. She dead and gone. Yeah, Carrie Washington. Mm-hmm. Because the white mm -hmm. man, she even told her, because she, she was half white, y'all. Her daddy was her, her, her daddy. It just was a mess. You know, this is how y'all white folk did, black people. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they yeah. want me to go to the whole day, day of it. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, let's talk about something else more pleasant because it was a horrible time. Yes. And all the people who got lynched were not identified. Yes. They, they're, they're not in the record now. No. Mm -hmm. no but, so ain't so. no need to talking about them. Okay. Mm -hmm. It was done back then. Mm -hmm. And I imagine they're doing it now. Mm -hmm. uh, but, Mama, the relationship between uh, blacks and white, you had some good relationships and then you had bad. Okay. So, so how was the relationship between blacks and white back during look that like, time? Look like the, I mean, they do pretty good. Mm -hmm. the, yeah. Especially good. in this area. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Because they built, uh, they um, built a grocery stores. Uh, mm -hmm. There was Spang. Spang may have been more recent, but there was Spang grocery store. Yeah. There's Lonnie yeah. McDavid uh, yeah. grocery store here in the uh, Jerusalem area. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Even though they made the money off of us. Yes, yes, they mm -hmm. did. Mr. Wilma Thomas. Yeah. Wilma yeah. Thomas yeah. grocery store at the corner of 21st Street and 156. Avenue. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. You have a question? Yeah, just a question. Until what grade did you go to school? Did you go to high school or did you just elementary? Or I was in high seventh grade. I did a school last okay. year. Mm -hmm. And when I got the seventh grade, my mama had a daughter lived at Avon Park and was married. My mama got on the train, caught the train from Warlow, and uh, carried me to her oldest daughter, who was married to Kenley Walker. And he, a black man, but he got down there, he got pretty rich, yeah, you know, wealthy, and she got me down there to go to school to finish the seventh grade. I finished the seventh grade. Grade, I uh, got a Jerusalem, and so she carried me with that. I got in eighth grade, I was passed to the eighth grade, and she carried me on to Avon Park to her oldest married daughter, Lizzie. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There we, I was at going to school, and I went to the eleventh grade there. Looked like Mama lost some money or something. Got going evil for me to continue to go to that school to finish. So I had to come on back here. 
mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I understood that the uh, school that was in Gordon only went to eighth grade. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. So the one here in Jerusalem went to what? Seventh. Seventh grade. And so if you didn't have money enough to go to Gainesville, Aquin Jones, or some other school, then that was it for you. And people didn't, the good thing about it is they didn't drop out of school. Mm -hmm. They just went as far as, as they could. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Could afford to go. Oh, could afford to go. Exactly. Okay. All right. Sounds like we've um, covered a lot of area. And we, 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 we excuse me? high school and even did some college. Yes, I did. I well, let's, tell, let's add that yeah, part. Please. So you, uh, after you went to Avon Park, which is what, South Florida? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. After you went there uh, to 11th grade, later you went back to... Back here to Gainesville to... Uh, oh, God. Is that Aquin Jones? No. What, what they call it? Build up out there. It was a program... Uh, Oh, 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 out in Alachua? Yeah. Oh, ACT? No, it's in Gainesville. Uh, it, uh, she went back to old uh, Buholtz, wasn't it, Mama? It wasn't Buholtz. It was, it was, it was, it was Aquin Jones. Jones. Old Lincoln. <laughs> old Lincoln. O old Lincoln. It was Lincoln. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, Aquin Jones now was old Lincoln. Oh. Okay. Uh huh. So she may have uh, attended Lincoln mm -hmm. and finished yeah. mm -hmm. at Lincoln. What year was that? Because I don't know. Don't ask me. Don't ask me. No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but she, you know, went to Santa Fe Community College. Yes, yeah, that's where I was. Yeah. Where yeah. Was the high school, what, what did you major? What were you Maybe taking? taking teacher. Teaching? Mm hmm. Wow. Yeah. Ooh. It was her GED that she got, mm -hmm. and then she went to Santa Fe. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Santa Fe? Uh, uh, a little over a year. Yeah, because oh. it was only a two-year mm -hmm. curriculum. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but mm -hmm. I wanted to know if she went for the two, mm -hmm. not the mm -hmm. full two. Mm -hmm. no. Well, that still is great. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Some of us older folks know how to go back to school. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you all so much. Mother, we just, uh, I can't help calling you mother. <laughs> that's all right. Mm. They, that's what they call me a, a church of gold by faith. Yes, yes. Mother Ross, they call me. Uh -huh. <laughs> that's what they call me. But you'd rather be called Sister Ross. Mm, well, <laughs> you're right. You're right. I guess so. <laughs> It's, you are Sister Rose. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. S Sister Mary um, Hobbs Wilson Ross. Yeah, I just got the uh, text. They tried to take me to the back and catch the church for my church. The church gave her a statement. Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Um, Papa, what did I do with my purse? Right there. I, I, um, now... I got to um, I got to keep my habit going. Yeah. My yeah. habit my habit is whenever uh, you have a birthday, we have to recognize your birthday. Okay. Uh huh. And uh, at this time, uh, I was going to ask you if you had um, um, cash out. I do. Okay. So what what I'm going to do is go ahead and. Um, Put in your hands the 101 because we have to give you a dollar for every year you are, your age, your 101. Okay? Say, what do you say, sis? That's what the church gave, 101. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. So we're, we're, uh, we're going to, on behalf of the uh, Manioka Gordon Lake Cross Subcommittee of the Truth and Reconciliation. We want to present to you $101, $1 for every year you are old. And we just praise and thank the Almighty 
for to be able to even see you. No, to be able to to know that you're here. Yeah, and, yeah. And look look at your mind. Your mind is good. Your yeah. speech is great. Yeah. You know, you're yeah. just marvelous. It just yeah. encourages us not to give up. No. Don't no. give up. Don't give out. And don't give up. Okay. I'll get drawn pretty good. Well, at this age, I do. Mm-hmm. And you walk so well. Uh, you have I a think. stick, but I think you can leave the stick behind. I just thank God for it. But goodness, God goodness, I guess what got me here. Maybe up to 100 and y'all say one. I knew I was born in 21. March 18, 19, March 18, 1921. Mm -hmm. And I've come from there off into this, what they call it, y'all? 20, the in. 2022. Mm -hmm. Isn't that a long time? Yeah, long. Ooh, that's a long time. It is, yeah. Mm-hmm. You've seen a lot of things, haven't you? Yeah, yes, Lord, and you heard about it. Seen some of it, you heard about it. Mm. Thank God. But by, I guess God taking care of me or something, why I wasn't needed, you know, been gone too. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Well, it's a reason. Yes, yeah, it's a reason. It's a good reason. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. you must have done something to allow God yeah, yeah. to have yeah. mercy on you, to allow you to still be around. Yes. Yeah. That's right. With a reasonable portion, portion of mm -hmm. health and strength. Uh, yes. Happy birthday, Mother, here. Thank you. Oh, yes, thank take, you. Take it with your right hand. Oh, oh, well. Right. Okay. Thank you, thank you. I left it blank. Yeah, and I love you all. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. So getting old has its advantages, doesn't it? Getting old has a, a, a oh, benefit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I say the Lord taking care of me, taking care of me right on. That's it? Yes. That's it. A lot of blessings come to Yes, mm -hmm. blessings. They mm -hmm. do. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm I don't know why. <laughs> Nothing like both all of that. Uh, mm -hmm. See, no. Uh, mm -mm. Mm -hmm. In my younger days, oh, yeah, I could just dress up and buy things and strut around and everything. <laughs> you would <were> strut? <laughs> oh, yes, sir. Yeah, I done my potion. <laughs> <laughs> now, you know, strut, strut means you, you, you really. Oh, yes, sir. So you really strutted, huh? Yeah, yes. Well, doesn't my portion what the Lord meant for me to do? I did it. Yes, sir. <laughs> but now, look at me. Can't hardly go. No, right. you're going very well. <laughs> you're doing very well. I'm the yeah. one that can't hardly go. You're doing very well. <laughs> yes. If you had to say something to young people, us who are younger than you, I tell them about the Lord. I ain't telling about all this messes that they gave God. God, they got mm -hmm. younger. Joe. I tell them about God and tell them how I was brought up. Mm -hmm. You know, are supposed to tell them. Mm -hmm. so I sure will. How were you brought up? Her mom and them brought me going to uh, Sunday school for mm -hmm. starting me Sunday school and by church and how to pray and what mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. how to. Well, I didn't know what a lie or sin it was. She had to tell me what it was. Don't steal. Don't sassy people out. Don't bother nothing what don't belongs to you. I was taught all of that. Mm -hmm. And I have worked for many white people. Never, never mm -hmm. stole anything. Mm -hmm. What kind of what you thought I'd done when I got up old enough to go, uh, Going there, taking care of these children and bathing them. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, I did. Mm -hmm. You need to say that I did. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, yes, I did. Even stayed in the house. Even the children even slept with me. Carried them to my house. And they mm -hmm. slept while they white people gone 
are visiting, mm -hmm. we didn't want to go. They need to chill up with me. I was brought up with white folk too, not only the black ones. Mm -hmm. I sure was, since I got grown enough to help take care of myself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You see how old I am, is, a hundred and something years old, you know I'm working for many white women. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. ain't the to tell Mm -hmm. Oh, I told them, and I got in the hospital yard in Jacksonville. I told them how I worked there for them. Mm -hmm. And it came to tell me. Mm -hmm. And I got it older. You made a good living. Yeah. You made a good living. Mm -hmm. Yes, you yeah, did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I done that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. were kind to you. Oh, yes. Yeah, very mm -hmm. kind. Because mm -hmm. so, I can remember them sending little clothes home. Yes. Mm -hmm. that, so so they, they can't, mean, can you hear that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, we, we wore. Sending books mm -hmm. for us to read. Wow. So she worked for good people. My, mm -hmm. Wow. And it passed on mm -hmm. because I don't know much about Jean, but I uh, I was maybe in Virginia or in Gainesville, whatever, but I heard that um, sister, this is Sister Gloria um, Wilson, Wilson Trotman. Trotman. Her husband is uh, the Reverend George Trotman the pastor of Atlas AME Church here in the, Mon in the Jerusalem, Oak area. But she, when she went to school, a uh, straight-A student, straight-A student, she and her daughter both graduated the same time, straight-A students. Oh, so, yes, they were. So, she so, telling the truth. Mm -hmm. You telling the truth. Mm -hmm. So it passed down from this glorious woman to her children, mm -hmm. and I, I don't know much about what Jean has done, but I, I know I know that Fam for a fact. Fam, you graduate, all right? Yeah, mm -hmm. Tallahassee. Mm -hmm. You <laughs> sent your money, huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> I meant for my children to go to college. Mm -hmm. Is <laughs> is Lana Mae David children? I was barefoot, and they tell them to going to the bus, the ride, but that's all right. I made it. Look at the way I come from. Mm -hmm. And they was they riding buses. I don't know whether them children made it or not, but that oldest boy out in the field plying barefoot the line and make these. Oh, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what he was doing. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll say this. When um, she always wanted to be a teacher, mm -hmm. and I was going to Sister Trotman is an awesome teacher. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then she went to college and married a, a, a tele, tele college, married a man out there. He good. Look who, what he got built up for. That <laughs> mom, there and that, you know, the mom, three, I have three girls already, if mine was born. They was come up. Good and they partly married pretty good black men. Mm -hmm. They showed the hard working mm -hmm. men too. Name, name all your children in the in the uh, order, in the order that they were born. The oldest one is well, they, my it, oldest one is Aaron. Aaron Wilson. Yeah. Who's next? Henry was Henry next. Wilson. Uh, Al Junior after your daddy named him. Uh, Eddie, Eddie Eddie Wilson. And then my little girl, Evelyn. Evelyn Wilson. Mm -hmm. She a Jacksonville. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And then um, Jean. Uh, uh, Mary Jean mm -hmm. Wilson. Mm -hmm. And the last one, the baby. She's the baby. Mm -hmm. Glory Jean yeah. Wilson Trotman. That's right. Wow. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Well, you did pretty good, young yeah. lady. Yeah. And I thank God for it. Yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. if, they, if they do get on my nerves, well, they grow up too. Thank you so much. They grow up. That, that means you have good sense. That yeah. means you have good sense. Yeah, they grow and they do what they want to do, and they, they got children going to college mm -hmm. and done finish. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they fully grow. I can't do nothing but talk. That's all. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> but talk. That's all. That's all. That's all I can uh -huh. do. Uh -huh. 
Well, you do a pretty good job. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we love you so dearly. Yeah, thank uh, you. And thank you for sticking around. Yeah. And letting them get on your nerves. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, oh. they, they get on my nerves. They, they tell them they ain't doing like I want them to do. That's it. Uh -huh. They sure don't. Uh -huh. They won't go to church like I want to see them go. Some of the younger ones. The younger ones. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They, they, they will remember what you've said to them, though. Right. They will remember. They may not show you now. Yeah, you right. Yeah, because yeah. the oldest boy of mine that died, he said, Ma, now I see what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Now I see what you were trying to get me to see. Yeah. And so those younger generations, they will come around and have the same opinion about the great things that you taught them. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Are there any final words? Because I think our time is far spent. Are there any final words that you want to say? Anything else you want to say? Uh -huh. Uh, we must have been having, we must have been having fun, huh? The time is. Uh -huh. What? Was it any did, What time is it? Uh, oh, uh huh. Yeah. Okay. But well, we got started around eleven thirty. So. Anything you want to say? Any final words? Oh. How did you enjoy the interview? Well, I, yeah, I this. I, I enjoyed it. Mm hmm Yeah, I really did. Mm hmm yeah. Yeah. Do you remember things that you hadn't thought of? Before? Oh, yes, that's right. I remember things that mm -hmm. I ain't thought about. Mm-hmm. Don't mm -hmm. forget them, I guess. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Mm hmm I'm glad you mentioned about the school because yeah. I've been trying to tell people, uh, Evangelist Doris Reed, may she rest in peace, told me there was a school, used to be a school in this Jerusalem area. Mm hmm so I'm glad you uh, confirmed that for yes, us. Yes, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, we knew about the one in Gordon, oh, but, yes. but there was one here also. Mm -hmm. And nobody knows the, the boundary between Gordon and Monio. Nobody knows the mm -hmm. boundary. You know, yeah. we, we all just say Monio Gordon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, yeah. so no, any final words you have for us? No. No, i glad y'all come. And okay. We had this talk. Mm -hmm. I enjoyed it. Everything. Okay. okay. Thank you all. Yeah. Samuel yeah. Proctor, Aura yeah. History. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for uh -huh. having us here. Yes. Today. Oh, it's been a pleasure. Okay. Great pleasure. Yes.